Forest Saunders at the Capitol is Florida headed for a quote U-turn on its special taxing district with Disney. The governor says no. Here's a closer look. You might remember this all started after Disney took issue with HB 1557 last session, a law critics called the Don't Say Gay Bill. And a California company needs to respect Florida values if they want to do business there. It prompted Republicans to look at the private company's autonomy, taking issue with Reedy Creek's power to carry debt, use eminent domain, or build a nuclear power plant. 23 yeas, 16 nays, Mr. President. So the bill passes. In April, the GOP majority passed their law dissolving the district by next June and gave Disney until then to cut a new deal. The governor is firm in his stance and, and we firmly support uh, his position. Future House Speaker and current rules chair Danny Perez tells us he hasn't heard anything beyond what the governor's office said Friday that a, quote, plan is in the works and coming, quote, soon. He was also confident it'll be substantive, especially with Bob Iger back as Disney CEO. There have been comments that have been made by the new CEO where he essentially uh, said that he wished Disney wasn't in the position that it currently is in with the state government. But new reporting from the Financial Times indicates lawmakers are considering a, quote, U-turn, citing unnamed sources. The article says members are looking at minimal changes, prompting opponents to suggest this was all for show. The entire canceling of Reedy Creek and Disney was a political performance by Governor Ron DeSantis. Disney should hire him. He's such a good actor. The governor's office has pushed back hard on talk of a, quote, U-turn. Comms director Taryn Fenske calling it, quote, <whistles> fake news in a tweet. Press Secretary Brian Griffin said in a statement, quote, Governor DeSantis does not make U-turns. We will have an even playing field for businesses in Florida, and the state certainly owes no special favors to one company. One of the biggest concerns about the special district and dissolving it, what happens to the about a billion dollars worth of debt that Reedy Creek holds? Does it go on the taxpayers? Governor DeSantis has consistently said no, and a new deal might potentially alleviate that concern. We'll have to wait and see. And we did reach out to Disney for comment on this story, but they haven't responded. That's the latest out of here at the Capitol. I'm Forrest Saunders reporting.